developing at 11, a new round of chaos at Cincinnati City Hall with council member Wendell Young accusing Mayor John Cranley of bribery. All of this stems from the standoff over whether the to fire city manager Harry Black and the mayor's attempt to get five votes on council to approve a severance package. Now, in a statement, Young says Mayor Cranley asked me what I wanted from him for my vote in supporting his ordinance. Young says he hung up right away. Young also says he'll take this to the U.S. Attorney's Office tomorrow. Now, in response, Mayor Cranley calls the allegations, quote, frivolous and also says this is nothing more than another in a long line of silly political stunts offered up by Councilman Young. Hamilton County Prosecutor Joe Dieters also weighing in. He says he doesn't think a crime was committed. In his words, this is going nowhere. Now, all of this comes on the eve of another council confrontation over a proposed severance package for the city manager. Ashley Zilka has that for us tonight. Ashley. Craig and Tanya, another day, another showdown here at City Hall. On top of this dispute between the mayor and Councilman Young, Cincinnati's city manager could be out by this time tomorrow. Let's rewind back to last Wednesday. Nine on your side was at council when at the last minute, Mayor Cranley pulled a severance package for city manager Harry Black from the agenda. We should take some time over the next week to have a whole host of discussions. As a city manager, you must be able to compartmentalize in an extreme way. So being able to do that is very helpful. The mayor and Black both agreed that $423,000 would put their public dispute in the rearview mirror. But council is split on it. Department heads are not sure if he's staying or not. So the city is at a standstill and people are hard are having a difficult time moving forward. But others on council, including Wendell Young, won an investigation by a special counsel into allegations the manager has harassed and retaliated against city workers. In this case, the mayor has yet to show council any reason why Mr. Black should not be the city manager. So he needs to put up or shut up. And we, of course, will be here at City Hall tomorrow for that council meeting. We will also stay on top of Wendell Young's complaint against the mayor. Reporting live tonight, Ashley Zilka, 9 on your side.